I believe that knowledge is power. And this is why so many people in America especially feel powerless because they have no knowledge. It is written in the Old Testament that my people are dying from a lack of knowledge. And that's certainly true. Today people are dying, they're, they're wasting their lives away because they're ignorant, ill-informed, and unread as to how the world works. As long as civilization does not understand where we have come from, where we are now, and where is the whole human race going in the future. If you don't have that kind of spiritual vision, then we're going to perish. Because all of us are nothing more than sitting ducks. Unless you understand freedom and how, how it, where it came from, and how it was obtained, and unless you start thinking in terms of protecting your rights and your freedoms, for he who would be deceived, let him. You need to educate yourself about how the world really works. Because until such time as you have educated yourself and understand that knowledge is power. power, power, oh. power, power. Because as long as you don't understand how you are being used, how you are being lied to, mistreated, deceived, you're never going to be able to get out of the mess we're in. That's absurd. Knowledge is the key. And again, maybe not. And unfortunately, too many people are preoccupied with watching television and sports and trying to make a dollar just to stay alive. They don't realize what's really going on behind the scenes in our country of America and around the world. Who is running this planet and what are they doing to the human race? Unless and until we wake up and begin to take back the sovereignty of our own minds, forget about television, forget about all the nonsensical entertainment that we are bombarded with, fantastic. Let's face it. and begin to start thinking seriously about your life and where you've come from and where you're going. And what's going to happen to your children and your grandchildren when you're gone? You have better start waking up and understanding the world we live in is very, very serious trouble. And we need to wake up and understand how the world really works. Unless and until you educate yourself as to how your world operates, you're never really going to experience freedom. 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 Because as a man thinketh, so is he. That's what I hope to help you do. I'm Jordan Maxwell.
power of nothing. He got nothing. He's got no power over nothing. This is a white man's country. This is a white man's world. White man from Europe dominates the whole planet. White men go to any country and kill everybody. Take over anything they want. This is a white man's country. It's a white man's world. I'm not bragging about it. I'm just telling the state. I'm just telling you the fact of the matter. White people out of Europe have dominated Europe and have dominated the and Europe has dominated the world. And so England has manipulated and exploited the races, the peoples of the world. The white man has been using uh, exploitation, commerce to manipulate and exploit the whole human race. So I cannot believe that some young black guy who walks in and he's going to take over the old white man's establishment on the earth. Ain't going to happen. No. They brought him in for some reason to make him look like a schmuck one of these days soon. But he is not in control. Obama's just a front man. They get rid of him like they did Kennedy. He's a, he's a very powerful man, John Kennedy. Everybody loved him. Handsome, debonair, president of the United States, wealthy, and they shot this guy in public and nobody went to jail. Nobody's ever going to jail. Why? Because the powers that be that run this country will kill you. You think for one minute you're gonna get out of line and be important in this country, they'll they'll like you so thick. As a matter of fact, the California state has a, has a, I don't know if you know this or not, but the mafia have their own license plates in California. Do you know that? Yeah. The mafia has given their own license plates by the California state government. I know. But I've sat with them all and talked with them. And they have their own license plates. <clears throat> I had a, had a time, uh, I'll, I'll give you an example, an example of what I'm talking about, how government operates directly with the underworld. Christianity is sun worship based on astrology. 